I'm your Oshkosh neighborhood reporter, Seth Humanik. A traffic stop took a dangerous turn this weekend after police say a man took off after being pulled over near the intersection of South Park Avenue and Knapp Street. Police say the man then hit this house near the intersection of Gunther Street and Fifth Avenue before running away and being captured in a backyard about two blocks away. Police said in a statement that the man was first stopped around 10.30 on the night of June 25th for an operator license violation. Police say the man took off from the scene, but officers didn't go after him. Police say shortly after that happened, quote, a citizen called to report that this driver had struck the side of their home, causing minor damage to the siding on the house. I spoke with the homeowner who didn't want to go on camera, but she told me she didn't call police and officers were the ones who notified her of what happened. A neighbor told me she was the one who called police. Well, I first uh, called them and told them where it happened and everything. Amanda Ruby and Ariel Anderson Ruby live across the street from the house that was hit. They gave slightly different versions of the events than police as far as time and day. I want to say it was between uh, 11 and midnight. Uh, we were inside watching a movie and uh, we heard a squeal. We run to the door and we see across the street there is a, an orange Pontiac in that yard. They also claimed the incident happened on June 24th, not the 25th, as police said. What day was that? Saturday. Yep, Saturday. We reached out to the police to clarify the differing stories, but did not hear back. The man was arrested for six different offenses, including hit and run and a fifth offense of OWI. The district attorney's office tells me he has not yet been charged. In Oshkosh, Seth Humanik, NBC 26.